All right. I have my new Game Plus set up. Um, we're going to be tinkering around with this a little bit for the next few days while I finish off my Dragon's Dogma 2 content. And then we'll be starting to weave back in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth today and tomorrow. I already started doing some more Days Gone last night. And we're already looking ahead towards April. There's a vote up on YouTube right now. If you want to vote between uh, what's my next game, big playthrough is either going to be Ghosts of, Ghost of Tsushima or Death Stranding. So go vote over on YouTube now. Um, otherwise, I wanted to do some more. I want, I want to see more. Um, so we're in New Game Plus mode now. Specifically, you know what I need to do though before we go out any further? I need to set up my vocation, or my... Um, Augments. I don't think I did my augments yesterday. I know I got my pawns hired, but I don't remember doing augments. A ladder. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like to change your vocation. I don't want to change. Aha! I knew I forgot. Um. Yes. 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 Um. Yes. Yes, and I'll take Radiance. Stigwell, we need to work on your augments. You've only got these ones. I'm going to have to have Stigwell maybe take on another vocation so I can start getting some... Um... Because he's only been a fighter, and I wouldn't mind. Let's look. Like, let's see what I can get if I go warrior. Well, I want to view the augments. How do I do the augment details? There we go. Vitality for sure. Impact. Yeah. Why don't I switch him over to? I wonder if he can still use the tank gear, just not the weapon. Let's try it. Well, th I'm not actually going to be playing them. It's going to be someone else playing it. Alright, I should be able to use the same armor, maybe. Hopefully. No, I can't. No, hang on. I can use some of it. I just can't use the helmet. That's interesting. So the Griffic helm is only usable by the fighter. So I'm going to have... I kept the gear, so I can still use the gear. I can still use the pants. So the only thing I'm really losing out is the helmet and the weapon. Oh, I need to stash this stuff. Okay. Hold up. Wait a minute. <laughs> we got to redo some stuff. Uh, Skyward Center, yes. Rending Sweet, yes. Core skills. I need to redo all these. Come see me anytime. I don't know if those still count, but they should. All right, uh, give secret token. I think we're good. Um, I've only got one rank to go. I kind of wanted to try a new ability today. Um, we're going to ditch Candescent Orb, and I'm going to get... I think it's this one, Sagittate Downpour. Yes, this is the one I'm looking for. What is Bartizan? Erects a barrier around an ally blocking incoming attacks. That's interesting.
spark chain steak. Oh, we're going to try that too, baby. Get a couple of new abilities here. Why not? Get deeper into the magic archer. All right, I think that'll be fine. That'll give me a couple new things to try out. Always a pleasure. I need to go store things. Do I have access to storage here or not? I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like yep, to change storage. your vocation, uh, you can see me anytime. Squirrel says, now that you played through and tested the vacations, what would you say is the most fun to play and what is the most OP? I don't know if there's OP. Um, different people are going to have OP opinions. Um, I don't really see any of them as being OP. Um, I like the Magic Archer. I mean, it's it's pretty potent, but I think every build in the right hands can be pretty potent. Oh, I kept the God's I kept the God's Bane blade for some reason. That's interesting. It carries through with you. All right, well we can stash that for now. Okay, that's a pretty good starting point now. We've ditched all of our gear. Always a pleasure. We've try I'm I'm doing new skills now with my magic archer, so it's I'm gonna have to learn a new rotation. Alright, we have a question mark up here. Sir Ricardo is in need of our aid. If you would be so kind as to follow me, I shall take you to the one you seek. I will follow you here momentarily. Well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. If your plane arisen in search of preferable tree... A treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Where? Yeah. Can I, if I jump out of there, I'm going to fall down. <coughs> Excuse me. So it gave us a vision of a treasure chest, which we, I'm sure we can go get if we want. Right. Let's get out of here. Follow me. Ah. Let's go rescue the dude. And I got some new abilities to try. Um, let's let's see what these look like really quick. Spark spark chain steak. Blaze. Oh, I've already used blaze thing. Sagittate downpour. This way, master. Okay, that's cool. So it does like the sparks. That's awesome. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. Try not to get hit, lest all that vim go to waste. to do hang on okay let's 
So it's this one. That was well thought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. No, nope, we're gonna no try doubt. this. One. While in another world, one Oh, that's going to be a really cool ability for when I need to do, like, hard targets. You know when you get the hard targets where it's like you need to hit the heart or something? That's going to be the ability we want to use. I'm just going to be really cool to see what it gets to when we get it uh, higher up. Is that all of them? Yeah. You have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. Paralyzed with fear, sir. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder, till I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Well, I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. All right, so is that an automatic Shall quest completion? No, we need to report back. The creature's corpse will serve us well. Be sure to aim true. Let's go turn in. Here we are. Hey, old friend. Many thanks for aiding Ocado. It was a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. Aye, that it was. The poor son might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. It was a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. That much was made well clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits into shape with their grueling regime. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. This ladder can take us to new heights. All right, so we've reported person. back to Phil, turned in a quest. A visit to Melv might jog your memory, Master. It seems the village yet reels from the dragon's assault. I think that's the only quest we have right now. Pray, allow me to show you the way. Yep. Lead on, Azrael. Is yours. <coughs> Lead on. Take me to the next destination. So this is essentially like playing it the first time but the one thing i will Come notice think of it. is that the, it's a Probably much easier to deal with like the goblins and everything like, so far along the way because really we're level 35 now one. instead of being level one be sure to keep that in mind like hang on we got harpies up here so i just launched two of those stakes that's my magic drawn to an elemental really cool obviously I need to level those up so and here I was hoping for some great treasure I heard a horn feel a fool it will find a use for it I'm sure <laughs> This is kind of a cool spell, the electric man. It roots him in place. And Not gonna lie. Performance. That's a pretty cool new ability. Follow me if you would. Tis the plan. It 
It's very interesting to see the survivability of Stigwell this time around as well, too, because um, first time around, to notice, we've all got different he, you know, we were tank and spank, sword board. This time around, I'm going to go the warrior route with that well. two-handed weapon, so we it's like... Each of us own our skills. A jack of all trades is a master interesting of to see the DPS difference. Mel, the stronghold raised by dragon's fire. So this is Mel. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. We may have to walk through the... Why'd you just call me pitiful, sir? I not do anything to you. I'm about ready for a break. I'm an innocent. Why did I just get stopped? Oh, we're gonna about to, we're about to get attacked. I think. Leave me alone, bro. That is most unfortunate, but it doth not release thee from thy fate. Feet, kill its feet. Pray, send help. You know what? We saw this all yesterday, two days ago, whatever. I don't need to see that again. Cutscenes be gone. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. I'm alive. Thank goodness. How are you feeling? I am feeling better, thank this you for asking. This is the second time I've watched over you like this. Ah. Isn't it? So it's keeping track. You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood mm. the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was terrible. I have thought mm -hmm. your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. You hung on and by some miracle survived. No miracle. It's called the dragon. Arisen. I seem to become I'm arisen. To what to do with why you were taken to the they said it was yes so that your yes this is all treated. true this is all true I am of the border watch yep someone with arisen like ability came to this village calling in tongues know you all of this has he come for you we are to part so soon then mayhap you will visit me again someday oh sure why not well then. It's nice to have a village maiden in your pocket. Arisen. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. I'm glad I found you. The ruler of Vermont. 
currently convalescing in the capital became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. Oh, but forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Copy that. Who might have the answers we need? Uh, shall we ask? Oh, have you some business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. It's quests. Oh, no. I'm not lost. Or I'm in a this is the kid that wants the... I don't need to listen to all this. I remember her quest. I'm going to offer my aid because I do want the quest you XP. Did, I suppose there's no harm in that. Seems my luck's not as rotten as I... Okay. Remember we correctly, we can just go in here and buy it. Ourselves, or simply purchase some at Rune's Apothecary here in Melv. Fruit Roverant. I think I get the idea. Ah, well met. Here for some fruit, Roverant, are we? Yep. Fruit Roverant. Do come again. I love the Sorry, fact that your gold carries good. over. Because, uh, I've got plenty of coin now. Hello again, sir. Say, have you brought some fruit Roverant for me? I have. So this, I haven't much to offer in return, but I'll be sure to tell Grandfather what you did for us. Such moments make me proud to serve the Arisen. Well, Matt, you're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? Yes. She told me all about it. It was a very brave thing you did. It was. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. This is like yeah, one of those Skyrim yeah, conversations, one of those Starfield conversations, where you're just talking into thin air. <laughs> it's a great outfit, says Lady Atari. It's not my favorite, but it is a decent one. Um, I liked the default magic archer gear they gave you, but the stats are horrible, so I'm not wearing it anymore. Now, tell but me, visually, it looks the coolest. The guild? Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild... Well, now, that won't do. <coughs> Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Very well. There is no wrong choice. But I shan't take up any more of your time. Fre this ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. So this is where you've been. Come with me to the village entrance. The watchhead's waiting for you. What say okay. we gather some information? Lead on. By now. Mayhap this time I went looking for them. Rat. I do love the bow with this character, though. Fast. I can hardly keep you in my sight. My bow is pretty cool. No like, time to catch your breath. Try to keep up. Tis a pretty awesome bow. <laughs> ah, first and foremost. Will you accompany me to the capital? My thanks. Are you ready to depart? Or do yeah, the first time? the first set of magical archer gear is like it looks very elvish. So it looks like it literally, I would say, looks it looks very similar to like what you see in the Lord of the Rings films that Peter Jackson did with like the elven outfits. It's very long and flowing. It's very beautiful, but the stats just weren't that great, unfortunately. Good. Then let us be on our way. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Oop, oop, oop. Oop. Some... Goblins, master. One cannot be Let my magic imbue you. 
Alright, Stig will just win up some vocation ranks in that fighter class, which we're going to have to uh, rank him up more in. I can't wait to get more abilities. It's really cool to see how he fleshes out this time. At last, the moment I've been waiting for. Allow Am I going to go see... I think that that's a bullshit phrase, though, Madison. It's such a bullshit phrase. People are like, the true ending. There is no such thing as a true ending. That's like trying to say that Baldur's Gate 3 has a true ending. Or that, you know, there are just multiple endings, so. I hope you weren't expecting mercy. Would you care to see a sorcerer's magic in action? God, our, our DPS is so much more this you time are around. Mighty indeed, Arisen. The short answer is no, I'm not. I, I am. I never oh, said. I told people I from the day I started playing this here. game, I said I will not be doing a completionist run. And I have seen like over the last 24 hours, probably 50 comments from people who are all bitchy and moany that I'm not doing a completionist version of this game. Ah. For those who want to do it, go for it. You know, that's the beauty of like Baldur's Gate 3, Rogue Trader, Icewind Dale, all these games that have multiple endings is that you can go do all the endings that you want to do if you want to. But if you don't want to, you get the ending you want, you move on to the next game. Literally that simple. Triggered! Arisen is the lawful ruler of Berman. So it has always been. Prepare I may do a video on that topic. To we'll see. Yet, the whole idea that if you don't completionist a game, you're not actually playing the game, and that's Our such bullshit. I don't know if I can bring these down. Here! Strike with lightning on your side. I can't bring him down with the. It's the. Um, what is this ability I have? S Spark chain stake. I think it only works on um, ground targets. It doesn't seem to work on the uh, the air targets. I could also point to Baldur's Gate 3 and how Baldur's Gate 3 has lots of additional areas to explore if you choose to go the completionist option. But it's not obligatory. And just because you... Ch like, you you could literally... You could ignore I can't wait to find out what's the Underdark completely. You could ignore the Mountain Pass completely in Baldur's Gate 3. Just because you don't go do those in one of your playthroughs doesn't mean you didn't get the true ending of Baldur's Gate 3. I've got a video coming out about this because it is a, it is a, a bit of a BS uh, argument that I've heard. I'm, I'm totally fighting back against that mentality. Because for some reason people are getting triggered about the fact that I went through the playthrough in 30 hours. And it's like, and? What's your point? Like... There are lots of ways to play games, people, and that's why game. That's why developers provide lots of lots of options. And it was it's so funny to me how no one, because I literally had somebody on one of my videos yesterday, who who said that they were they were upset that I wasn't doing a completionist version of this game when I did a completionist version of Baldur's Gate 3, and I was like, I don't think you watched me play Baldur's Gate 3, because I did not do a Baldur's Gate 3 completionist run, nor did I. I, I always told people I wasn't going to. I did 115 hours in my first Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough. I probably could have done 200 had I done the completionist route. I didn't see half the shit of Act 3 that people were seeing. I never did the Thieves Guild stuff. I didn't do anything. And yet I still had a very satisfying run of Baldur's Gate 3. And to have somebody sit there and rag on me 
that I'm not doing the same thing with Dragon's Dogma 2. I don't have to play the same way for every game. I don't like every game the same way. So it's it's a very interesting commentary, but I think it's something that needs to be squashed because the idea that, that every game should be played exactly the same and that, and that if you don't do all of these things, you're not actually completing the game, that is such... Yeah, it's BS. It's BS, man. Good morning, I am. Is this That's a cave? Oh no, but I know what that is. That's one of those exploding things. Never mind, my mage already got it. <laughs> I was gonna shoot it down. Uh... There's too many games. Not everyone has time to be a completionist. Exactly, Lady Atara. Like, I think a lot of people forget too that I do this for a living. So my job is not to sit here and spend six months on a game. It's to get through the game, play the game, you know, give it 30, 40, 50 hours, whatever the gameplay exists as. It's kind of like if you played God of War, the most recent one, Ragnarok, like after you beat the game, you could keep going. There was all the, um, what did they call them? The, the, um, the, the winged, the Valhir, the Valkyrie, Valkyrie? The Valkyries, I think. You could go get all the Valkyries. You could go get all the, like, special warrior challenges. You could go to Musta, the, 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 the Lava Planet and do the trials and all that shit. The, the people who are saying that you have to do all that stuff or you didn't actually complete Dragon's Dogma 2, why weren't you saying that about God of War Ragnarok? Because it's bullshit to sit there and say that it's okay for one game but not another. Like, I don't get it. I really don't get it. Because you got... You got to the end of God of War Ragnarok. Credits rolled. That's the end of the game. Now, if you want to, you can go and do the Valkyries and the Trials and all that stuff and get, you know, max achievements or whatever. Else. But just because you choose not to does not mean you're not playing the real game, the true ending. I have a, I have a vomit reaction to that commentary for sure. I am says, what are you doing in Dragon's Dogma 2 this morning? I am working on, um, so I, I'm not quite maxed out on my vacation. I need one more rank in my vocation. And um, I gave Stigwell a completely different vocation. I have him as a soldier right now, or a fighter, whatever it's called, the two-handed weapon. And I'm leveling up two new arrows right now. So I'm in new game plus mode, table? and I am furthering my main pawn and myself in terms of abilities so that I can do an eventual max level um, magic archer guide and I've also got I've got like seven are, more guides that I'm working on this like week it. so um, I'm continuing to play a new game plus until I get all the guides done that I want to make and then I'll be moving on to other two uh, moving on to other things because um, I've got a lot of other projects a lot of other items in the fire. Um, so I'm not really doing anything specific since I've already played the game. But one of the things I'll do as I continue to play through is I'm going to go look at side quests I didn't do. I still oh, never I, I never met the Sphinx. Um, I never saw a pawn get the dragon sickness. Um, I didn't fully explore the elven area. There was probably, I think I had 10 or 12 side quests in my journal when I finished the first game that I could have done. So I'll be going and doing that kind of stuff um, with this playthrough in New Game Plus. But I'm not going to be doing a completionist run. And i it's highly unlikely that I will ever finish this run because I have no desire to. I, I, it's just, you know, i got a few more things I want to see, but that's about it. Very well. I shall go on ahead. I've been doing this a long time. Someone's saying I didn't. I honestly didn't know this was such a controversial subject. Subject. So I've been doing this a long time. I've played. I can't tell you how many games I've played. Um, this is. Um, I'm. This is my third year full time, and I've been doing game reviews and game playthroughs for probably five, six These years now. I have simple. never, never, ever, ever feet. seen the vitriol and commentary around the true ending until I finished this game and put up my. Um, my final thoughts video yesterday holy crap 
the amount of people that have come out of the woodwork and been like, you rushed, you didn't take your time, that's not the true ending, you gotta do this, that, the other, and there's the secret over here, and blah, 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 it's like, okay. Like, go do it. Doesn't mean I didn't get the, doesn't mean I didn't get the, the true ending. Um, just makes me chuckle. Hey, I'm, I'm making controversy today. You know, we're going to have uh, reaction videos coming out later. Uh, do I plan on maxing other vocations? Uh, I'm probably going to... Yes. I'm not, I don't know that I'll max it, but I'm going to go do a mage after I do this one. Because I did like the sorcerer in the first game. Um, so I'd like to try to get to the sorcerer in this game and just try it out and see. So I'll, I'll do some of those, but that's going to be something I do on the back burner. And... You know, I'll do it at my own pace, and I'll just release guides as I as I get stuff done. Lady Atara says, I personally like being a completionist, but don't expect people with a schedule to be the same way. The whole true ending rant is brand new to me. You should, yeah, you should definitely go. It's not just happening to me either. It's happening to any any person who finished Dragon's Dogma in in like under 50 hours is getting ranted at by people who are like you didn't actually play the game you rushed there's no way you saw the actual game if you logged less than 80 hours Meh. <laughs> i've never seen it like you get the random comment occasionally when you You're play games but i've never seen people master. go crazy over you, it but I find a good use. till this game It's truly amazing arisen. Um, I don't think there's anything else here we need to get, so let's continue onwards. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. I'd well, say what's with this guy? Is he not... We can carry. Lead on, dude. Where did he go? Now he's leading again. For some reason, he was following there. Exactly, Dribrom. When there's New Game Plus, you can do whatever you want, because then you can explore the other stuff in New Game Plus mode. It's like Starfield. You know, when I played Starfield, my first playthrough was like 350 hours. And then I was like, I'm done. I don't need to go through and play oh, NG plus 1, NG plus 5, NG plus 10. Like, I'm not going to go put 1,000 hours into Starfield. I got 350 hours. That was it. Like, I'm done. Like, But there are people out there who would comment that, Oh, you didn't actually play the game if you didn't go through all 10 levels of New Game Plus. It's weird. There's people out there. Yeah, the gatekeeping is pretty heavy is right now. With you, Watchhead, sir? Lots of ways to progress. True. An arisen. Another protector, <laughs> you mean? It is uncertain. But what? Impossible. I'm well aware of how preposterous the idea is. Thank if the claim is false, we will... All's been arranged. Come. Let us pass through the gate. All right. And this time around, because I'm, you know, I'm, I'm more inclined to max out vocations, level up new abilities, level up new vacations. This playthrough is more about, okay, here's all of these side areas that we didn't do the first time that we can go fully explore. Now I'm actively looking for caves to dive into, whereas before I didn't want to dive into the caves. An ox cart was meant to meet us. You know. It is nowhere in sight. Aught may have befallen it. Best we press on. Exactly, Crow. People should play how they want to play. It's your game to choose to go at your own pace. Now, Dribrom has a counterpoint and says you should play the game as the developer was intended to be played as well. That's not an untrue statement. However, here's here's the number one red flag that I'm seeing about this game is people who are saying secret ending, true ending. That's that's made up that's invented that is something that players have invented there is no you have to play it this way 
there there doesn't exist that type of stipulation on playing any game from any company. Um, one of the things, if you want to look at it as, as it was intended, is um, the level of jank. Like, is that what the developers intended? Well, it's what they published. So, you know what I mean? It's like, it's so open to interpretation. Backpack. Um, we don't need to camp yet, so we're good. Exactly. You know, if you spend 70 bucks on a game, my way, I play it my way. I always, I think the funnest thing for me is, um, as an example, I'll get people to tell me that I should play a certain class in a game. And it's like, did you buy the copy of the game? Because if you did, if you bought me a copy of the game, I'll play what you want me to play. But you didn't buy my copy of the game, Is so... Is everyone all right? <laughs> More marks of the dragon's fury. Its rampage must have weakened the earth here. I think that's more prevalent in MMOs where people are like, you need to play this spec specifically, and if you don't... I'm getting the, I'm getting some of that here on this game. You, you get the people well, who are like really talking about how if it takes you more than 90 seconds to kill a dragon, you're failing at Dragon's Dogma 2, and you just don't know how to play. And it's like, wow. All right. Let my magic draw into you in an immense mood. What is this? Can we flip the cart? Or is this just the... Dare I say it? We trounced our foe, well and true. Well, I'm sure there's still room for improvement. We did trounce them. Well, do you guys remember the conversations around uh, Mass Effect 3 when the when it came out and all these polarizing opinions on what the ending should or shouldn't... Like, what ending you should or shouldn't have gotten, which was the canon ending. Like... I get it. People have opinions. Just because they have opinions doesn't mean they're right. <laughs> like... I dare say the cart shan't be traversing this. Onward. Oh, you're not, you're not a bad guy. I hear it. Where's it at? Did you guys attack it? Crazy psychopaths. Man, our DPS is so much better this time around. It's crazy. Take this. It is something I found. I wanted you to have it. This ability right here kicks ass, man. I grant you light they just time. melt. It's going to be really interesting when we start to get um, the second level of that. Alive. 
Do we got any more? Would that we might always be so in step. Hey. All right, another level up. So he'll be able to get some new abilities when we get back to town. Master. I'll gather this. It might be of use. One of the things that's sorely missing, and this is just a personal preference thing, but I just I like more map guidance in my games. Um, and even if there's not more map guidance more verbal guidance so here's a good example if you go back to red dead redemption 2 or assassin's creed odyssey the games had modes where you could turn the compass off and you would rely upon verbal instructions from the npcs on where to go and if you had the compasses turned off they would give you more directions than they would normally give players if they had the compasses turned on and i think that was a really good way to do this this game they don't explain shit um so you're kind of left a lot of times wondering where you're supposed to go in general vicinities how do you get there you have to go the roads oh i i am going to play the spear hand at some point crow it's on my list of vocations to try out i haven't unlocked uh yes i haven't unlocked two but i haven't um it looked really cool because i enjoyed the um jedi consular in, in star wars old republic which used the two-handed i did a jedi shadow and it was just a hell of a lot of fun we could pick some now and use them when the need arises Got camps over there to the right. Let's go over here. Or can we not get over here because of the bridge? Bridge is out. Boo. By your leave, Arisen. Well, I'm going the wrong way. Lead on, sir. Well, view of the landscape from up here. Mayhap I'll spot something of interest. Well, certain pawns do a better job, lady, of getting stuff for you as well. And also based on their specializations. I've got the, the Ultimate Beginner's Guide to Pawns is coming out tomorrow. And I got a whole bunch of information in there on how the pawn system works and everything else. Yeah, it's a good it's a good thing to have them be foragers, Madison, for sure. Ooh, I can't wait to find out what's inside. What's inside of what? What are you looking at, bro? So 
where I got sidetracked earlier. Dude, I hate picking stuff up, Madison. It sucks. It's like, go get it for me. Go fetch. Yeah, I set mine to Warrior this morning. Um, I did Tank and Spank. I did Sword and Board the whole way through the first time. And now I've got uh, my pawn doing... The uh, warrior for two-handed DPS. I'm gonna see how it rolls. That is what you wish arisen. I'll go on ahead. Look there. Methinks I spy aught of use. Let us ponder how best to proceed. Proceed. Well, I know the one thing I'm noticing is that all the combat that you're facing at this level is like face roll. And it's such a difference compared to when you first come through here as a new player. Lars says it's great to hear my pawn return and brag about the skill of the Arisen. <laughs> You're an expert warrior, my lord. What's this? We're trapped. Oh, I want to take this guy on. Let's do it. This is going to be fun. I think I will too, Crow. I, a to think oh, we got this. In the face. Can scarce stand a well placed strike or to send it game skyward. Strike fast and true, and our quarry shall fall. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. Dude, the difference this, this that made, because when I first you, took sir. that guy down, it took a long time and that one was like 30 seconds and it was toast I had taken you for another force arisen goodness knows we see a lot of I will say that that feels a lot better now that we're leveled up and got all our abilities and etc and I can't imagine what it's gonna be like once I get my main pawn leveled up more with this new vocation you're free to make your own way to the capital now of course if you'd rather continue to accompany us nope the road's blocked can't get the powerful current or to set this rock. What if I can blow it up with my rock or with my uh, arrow? My rock. Okay. I don't know if this will work or not. It did. Don't get swept away, kids. Dude, all of that is legitimate complaints, Crow. Combat gets repetitive long term. The same type of enemies over and over and over also gets repetitive long term. Um... Oh, there are so many RPGs coming out this year. I am. Star Wars Outlaws, Indiana Jones, Avowed. Those are just ones that uh, you know that I am waiting You're to well play. Of picking things up, aren't you? Oh, do we need to talk to him again? Ah, here's the cart now. Do you intend to join us? Nope. Very well. But for your own sake, I recommend you make your way to the capital. Don't care. I'm not going to the capital right now. We, I mean, we can, but um, I would rather make our way down here to explore some stuff and see if we can't find some more caves and stuff now that we... Although, hang on, I lied. I do want to take the ox cart, 
because I can go add abilities to my pawn. Riding in an ox cart would be a welcome reprieve. They can be most convenient, <coughs> though they travel only during the day. Let's roll. Why aren't we moving? Yo, cart driver. Tis dark as pitch, master. Pray, light your lantern before I trip. Pray, do not impede me, sir. I Why isn't the stupid cart going? Do I need to talk to the dude again? What is it? Changed your mind? I did. Very well. Board the ox cart and we'll be on. Hang on, we got cre we got creatures. You'll not live to rig these fiends will resurrect so long as their skulls remain intact. But fear not, I shall gladly smash every last one. We're sitting out. Jump on if you paid. Here we go. Oh, dude awakening is gonna be awesome, Madison. I um got some exciting Dune Awakening news coming up too that I can't wait to share with everybody. I know the team just got home from all their convention stuff, um, and they're going to be doing some upcoming. There's there's some announcements coming soon. It's going to be good. We got a we got a core group of people that are ready to move over. We're enjoying Enshrouded right now. By the way, the Enshrouded patch this that dropped yesterday is freaking amazing. Um, so we'll be back doing more enshrouded this weekend, but then um, we're all we're all waiting for uh, for that game. All right, I think we're done. Seems we drove them off. You've my thanks for aiding us. Burnworth isn't far from here. Will you join us the rest of the way? Sure. All right, into the ox. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. I'd say we collect as much as we can carry. I say you absolutely should. The following morning. No, I'm not, Hunter. I have some very specific goals that I'm targeting regarding some upcoming guides that I'm doing for the rest of the month, but once we're into April, I'll probably be done with Dragon's Dogma 2 completely. Moving on to other things. Right now there's a vote on YouTube. Am I going to play Ghosts of Tsushima or am I going to play Death Stranding next? We have Hellblade 2, Hellblade 1 and 2 I'm going to be doing in May. So for April I have a gap, so I'm going to be doing one of those. Plus I'm still finishing up Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. I was informed of your But that vote is over on YouTube for those of you who want to vote. I know we're multi-streaming on YouTube and Twitch today. Captain Brandt, this individual summoned a pawn through a rift stone. Several witnesses can attest to it. Though I admit I had my doubts at first. It would seem this is no mere deceiver. <laughs> this one's not a bad sort. Saved our hides on the way here. As decreed by the great will of our world, that arisen now resides within the palace. It follows, therefore, that this ruffian before us is not... You must submit to questioning. Yeah, yeah, he, where he's going to take me aside. This is all old news. I shall news. conduct the interrogation. <coughs> Excuse me. 
I beg your forgiveness for my insolence. If the Queen Regent had learned of you, I had no choice but to treat you as a pretender. Whatever. Lest my act. Your anger is well justified. I'm skipping all this stuff, everybody, because I just saw this the other day. So. Your rival would have. What I want to do is get to the point where I can go us. get my vocation and stuff done. That. However, with your majesty, I shall devise some plans to further. See you next time, brah. This one's cleared of all suspicion and has my permission to remain in the. Ouch. Pray forgive me, I'm in a bit of a hurry. <laughs> cool sonnet! Get back here! Good luck with that, boy. You there! Did you see an urchin in a cap run past just now? No. Nope. Can you tell me which way he went? Many thanks. I'll catch that wretch yet. It's the, uh, I think, yeah, it's, it's, the Ghost of Tsushima vote is, like, way, way huge. In fact, there's aught I would ask of you if you've the time to It's much more in favor of Ghost of Tsushima than it is in favor of Death Stranding. Oh, apologies, but our chat will have to wait. Till next we meet. Farewell. Ben Yetter asks, is Starfield worth playing? Fuck yes, it's worth playing, especially now. They've patched all the things. It's a great game. Does it have flaws? Yes. Have you watched my coverage of Dragon's Dogma 2? I poke holes at all of the flaws in Dragon's Dogma 2, and I poked holes at all of the flaws in Starfield. But despite the fact that it has flaws, every game has flaws, Starfield is 100% worth your time. Especially if you, if you have Game Pass, it doesn't cost anything. It's already included in your subscription, so it's totally worth playing. Um, I really enjoyed Starfield. Uh looking forward I, I bought the premium edition so I, i'm waiting for the expansion pack to come out um i loved the space combat space exploration all of that was fun starfield did it have jank yep it had just as much jank as this game has <laughs> but you know it doesn't take away from games being good all right i need to find a vocation guild oh and i need to buy a better sword for my for my dude <coughs> this ladder can take us to new heights. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. I've all manner of arms for sale. Come, have yourself a look. All right, I need to buy a big old two-hander from my for my pony pawn. Pony pawn pawn. Carnation. Holy shit. 600 damage? Oh, I can't use it though. Never mind. Which ones can I use? Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. 367, 427, 595, the wounded heart. 655. They've got some pretty significant weapons on these in my new game plus mode. Holy crap. Uh, it's 55,000. I don't have a problem buying that. I've, I've got plenty of gold. Yes, equip that purchase. Let's look at some enhancements. Oh, I need to buy a helm too. I wonder if the other guy's going to have a similar similar display of gear. That's way better than what Welcome they had the first time I played. Armory. You'll find only pieces of the f and quality is what you need if you want to survive. Helmet. Dude, they've got all sorts of new gear. None of this gear was here when I played through the first time. So this is like... 
is this based on level or is this just because I started New Game Plus? Look at that helmet. Look at that helmet. So this one's like three points less defense, but more magic defense. I think I might take... I like this one. I just like the look of this one. Hold up, though, because are there new breastplates that I can buy now? No. I, see, I still have... Holy shit, there's better gear than what I'm already wearing. Holy fuck, I didn't know that. 126,000 gold? Oh my god. Well, I now have... Uh, okay, H hold up a second. The only thing I need to buy is a helm. So before you check the price, just remember. Uh, let's sell. Yes. Hope to see you again. It is most exhilarating to hand over such a sum. These were necessary expenses. I'm gonna go I check magic no bows now. To every last coin. I've all manner of arms for sale. That's definitely better than what I'm um I'm using. But that's not a mat. No, hang on. Hang on. I'm looking at the wrong thing. That's red. I can't use that. Ah, here we go. Oh, I don't have enough money. No. All right. Well, I've got, I've decked my tank out. So now I know. Look at that bow right there. I want that so bad. The black wing bow. I can't, I can't, I can't even afford dragon's breath. <laughs> it's all right. I have a pretty good bow that I have right now. But that's really good to know that you have a whole other tier of gear. So guess what? Now I have a whole new Come, have yourself a look. objective now. I need to save up enough coin for a new... And look at his helmet now. Look at him. Oh, wow. And his giant-ass weapon. That big old axe? Holy crap. I've heard some interesting tidings about town. Regarding the Vermundian military, yes? <laughs> Would seem the Queen Regent has made significant alterations to the chain of command. Alright, this guy's... This guy offers me a quest, which I've already done. I'm skipping through this because we literally just did this like two days ago, but I want the quest just to have it. Because I want to go up to the elven area. Um, I want to go up to the elven area because I didn't explore up there a lot last time, so this might be a good, good quest to work on. Just buy a cheap old bow. Have yourself a look. These foreign bows do so intrigue me, but I shall admire them. You would simply give this to me? Fascinating. Such as this bowstring. Well, why do you stare? I suppose I sought inspiration. The timing could not be more. Forgive me. I should not. Every elf undergoes this trial. I have been training most diligently. Skip. Indeed. Skip. I fear my Skip. aim is I grew so vexed with myself. Thanks to I know. I know, buddy. I Let's go to the place the where you want to test your skills. Aim. Let's go. Many thanks. <laughs> I, look, this is no place to practice. Would you 
you be so kind as to that's meet you at the ruins north of Trevo Mine. Yep. For now. All right, that's our quest. Set is my priority quest, and we are now going to head out of town and go work on this. Displaying bowmanship for an elf. My hand would tremble on the string if it were me. Um, it's a long way away. I remember that much. Yeah, we need to go out. The, we need to go a little bit to but the I left. Expect you'll do just fine. <coughs> this is a so bit of a journey, so. I'll lead the way. This is something fun to work on. Oh, 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 oh! oh. One more thing I need to do before we go. I gotta go train Stigwell. I can't leave until I do that. We gotta go to the vacation now, guild. There's a worthy prize. If only it weren't so far away. Greetings. Welcome to the guild hall. Here we conduct all manner of procedures pertaining to vocations. If there is aught I may assist you with. Alright, sticky wiggy. Oh yeah, more hit points. Woot! Forgive me, but I'm afraid we are not accepting registration for warriors or sorcerers at this time. You see, as we currently have no archer staves or great swords on hand, and we cannot simply purchase more, so regrettably I cannot assist you. Let me see. What else can I tell you of our guild? All right, so I don't have any of the new those are those are the ones okay so what do we got here No, I think we're going to go revivify. Methinks Roderick will be able to tell. He runs the local armory. May fortune smile upon you, sir. <coughs> we know what we're looking for, but not where it is. I suppose there's naught for it but to start searching. You can start searching if you choose. I'm not going to. We are going on a quest. Now, this is a bit of a trek, so um, I should probably... I've got three caps. Holy crap, I didn't know I had those. I probably don't need so many camping supplies. It is a view that begs to be painted. <laughs> Yon shore in particular. For good or ill. We cannot truly know what awaits us till we tread the land ourselves. And I'm going at nightfall because I don't mind it being dangerous right now because we have plenty of abilities now. Well, that wasn't a homecoming I envisioned. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. Try God, we're just melting this. these. Lest all that vim goes to waste. So now they're just getting roasted by lightning. Look at that. on the road you'll not live to regret this you 
We are just melting things now that we've gotten higher levels. It's pretty impressive. Much obliged. Take this with my thanks. You're welcome. Thank you for the stoutness extract. It will be used in I'll harvest good what honor. I can, should it please you. Yeah, harvest away kids. We need to find like a minotaur or something. I need to I need to face like a challenging foe here. Because <clears throat> I've got some new abilities that I want to try out. The vanguard is yours. Lead on. Man, I just saw a harpy go flying above. I will protect you. Let my magic draw to you an elemental boon. That is a cool ability, whatever that is. When tarred, be sure to avoid open flames. I need look upon this sky for all eternity. I need, I need, I need. The crick in my neck. Keep gazing upward, and you'll like to stumble along. <coughs> yeah, Stigwell's weapon is pretty awesome. I didn't know there was more tiers of gear too, so that's really cool because. I need like 70,000 or whatever to go buy myself a new bow. Feast your eyes on this. God, we're just melting these things. I heard another one. Do well, it's I think it's just the combination of like we could pick some now. Max level abilities and max arises. gear and everything else. Thirty-six, baby. Spingle, what's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Come on. That's quite a large boulder, Did your brother wake you up? Yeah. Did your brother wake you up? Oh, you're purring. <laughs> Do I need to help defend you because your brother woke you up and tried to steal your your uh, sleep spot? What are you doing back there? You think you're gonna just stand up there on the back of my chair? This is my brand new chair. I don't think so, buddy.
Madison says there's got to be harder enemies at some point in New Game Plus. There better be, because so far, I haven't come across... Even the ogre was like 30 seconds and it was done. Hang on, I got another cat who wants to go out. Both of the uh, boys wanted to go out. Someone was just saying Death Stranding, Death Stranded would be boring to watch. <clears throat> um, that's what some people have descri described it as. What's up, KiraCraft? I'm answering some comments on YouTube right now about that. I think some people, it just depends. Um, if if certain people do like to watch action-based gameplay and they find they find walking simulator type things boring, but if if the people are there to hang out with the streamer and to be a part of a community and to support the streamer, then they don't give a shit <laughs> what that person is playing. And they don't find things boring because they're there to interact with that person. But other people are only showing up to watch the person play a specific type of game. So I get why it would be boring for some people. Not everyone wants to watch me play, you know, like when I, I've done, it's been a while. I haven't done it in a while. But like when I play MLB The Show or like NBA 2K or um matt you know madden or something when i play a sports game i have tried to stream sports games and do content around those games on my channel because i like those games i get jack shit for views because my audience is cued into like the rpg side of things so if i do anything that's off book the algorithm either doesn't show it to them or they just are like yeah i don't want to watch that um but you know i get where some people could see that stranding being a little bit boring 
Um, let me timestamp something here because I think this is a great conversation to have. Um, <clears throat> because it just showed up in my comments too. Hang on. All right. If we combine our strength, I say we give it a push. So the question Madison had dropped was, there's got to be harder enemies at some point in NG+. Maybe it's not a comment, or not a question so much as a comment. Well, interestingly enough was, as I was just taking a break to let a cat out and then check the comments, I had three or four comments from people on my New Game Plus video from this morning asking whether or not there's even any point to New Game Plus when you can just face walk. Like, I've yet to come across a mob that, like, even the the, the ogres and the cyclops and everything that we've faced in New Game Plus so far have just, I'm just wiping the ground with them. It's like there's zero challenge. Like, there has been literally zero challenge These in New Game Plus mode grown. so far. Like, none. It feels there's like I'm playing the game on easy mode, and I'm only level 36. Um, I started New Game Plus as strike. level 35. We find each other again. Um... Uh, let's see. Let's see if we get. This will be a big one. Let's try the Minotaur. Hang on. The Minotaur Here we go. This is a chance to see. Like, watch us melt him. I'm out of stamina right now, but do you see that? Where did he go? He jumped up somewhere, didn't he? Oh no, he's down. Sorry. He's like blending into the... There we go. Like that, that ability right there... Alright, so I just gotta say, if you watched my streams from the An first game, like, it, that guy, I wiped on Minotaurs, like, the first two or three times I came up against him. And now at, like, level 36 or whatever in New Game Plus, that, I don't even know, I didn't, I didn't timestamp it or anything, so I don't know how long that took, but that was, it felt like less than a minute. I don't know if that's actually true or not, but that was really, really, that was over super quick. Like, to be found? there it does not the appear to be any be enhanced difficulty for the new game plus mode, which honestly feels disappointing. Um, you would think that if we're in new game plus, like, things would be more challenging, but instead it's just like, oh no, we're just going to face roll everything now. Which feels weird. What do we got? Oh, there he is. It's just trivial mode at this point. Um, hmm. It's it's very very interesting why they didn't why they don't appear to have an increased difficulty for. Um, it's no more or less than what New Game Plus. We cannot expect this, like this ability right here, just melts them. It's like it's it's just it's just like what you're you're a mob and you want to do what? Hi. <laughs> does feel uh, incredibly satisfying having spent the first, you know, 30 hours of the game having things feel difficult. 
in some cases, you know, overly difficult. And now to be in New Game Plus, and it's like, oh no, you're you're you've suffered enough. It's your turn now. The Mantis says, I'm going to have to give my healer that Starflight skill. Looks cool at night. It does. Anyway, that's my little rant on... Uh, Displaying bowmanship for an elf. It's not a rant. My Discussion. Tremble on the strength of a, about New Game Plus. Because, yeah, it seems to just be, I guess, a way to go Thank explore God, side quests and stuff you missed the first time but not it doesn't seem to have any enhanced difficulty it just seems to be everything's on easy mode now i wonder if they'll patch that out later All right, I hear wolves. Caution is called for when crossing any bridge, regardless of its make. It seems safe enough, at least. Understood. <coughs> no. Would you mind coming over oh. here? I grant you lightning spang. Well, keep leading on, pet companion. They don't have their hand icon anymore, like they're no longer sure where they're supposed to go. Nope, we've got undead. Witness my magic! has left us a parting gift. I'll see it safely into my pack. Don't you worry. A curative ought to do the trick. Oh, suddenly she's guiding again. I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon, but at least I know I am up to the challenge. Cranberry? I like cranberry. <laughs> Alright, where you guys at? Come on. Anything for you, Arisen. Off I go. Alright, I'm following my companion through the woods. Oh, we're going into a tunnel. That's lovely. Are we gonna get eaten? That looks promising. Any ideas as to how we might reach it? <gasps> Did you just go through the water? What about the brine? I guess this is shallow water. Oh, true to your word, you have come. I know. Begin at once. Uh, <coughs> I, I should like to observe. Oh, I can't see the target. Oh, I can now. You have my gratitude. In fact, unlike those of Eld, I can see. Not so for those of Elven make, however. 
No, Mayhap you're good. You find the sentiments we are taught that arrows loosed with pro I admit, I find it with this bow. I feel like he would understand. he would benefit from the training of a Huzzah! of a magic archer. But hey, he likes the human bows, so. What a feat! I, I, I can hardly believe it. Every last arrow found its mark, dead center. This marvel is is nothing at all like an elven bow. To think that I should I should feel such a difference it is a strange thought. But how else to explain it? My arrows have not soared so true in all, in my, all days. my days. I'd nearly given up on myself. Yet it would seem I am not without talent after all. My performance with this bow has divested me of such doubts. But the ingenuity of this design. If only my people would take heed. It is all very well to talk of honing one's form, but why should we not perfect the tool so I am decided? With this all right, he's going to take it back to the arbor. <coughs> it seems Sir Glindor's doubts no longer plague him. May his newfound confidence see him through his trial of archery. With the bow you gifted me... All right, so he doesn't have the quest thing at this point in time. While traveling beyond the rift, I uncovered a treasure chest hidden in this very locale. Well, where's Shall the treasure we chest? Out? Yes. Oh, yes. Give me a moment to recall the way. I can guide you there if you wish. So he has an exclamation we have been given point. A destination. Shall we venture forth? I don't think I've ever paid attention to that. When you when when they're on the hunt for a thing they've told you about, it's not a guiding hand. It's an exclamation point. That's cool. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, old wager. Oh I say, shit, I'm gonna have to jump. Can carry. No! Stay with me, Arisen. Wait right there. <laughs> I suck at jumps, man. And Fuck! And I got bandits on me. A treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Yes, you should. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. There we go. That glowing light, man, that's cool as hell. All right, let's try this again. Nope, how do I? Okay, there we go. Ah, where was that chest over here? I've got a good feeling about this one. Forgotten Exploring tunnel. New locations as thrilling as tis daunting. I only hope we do not stumble Let's go, kids. Into any traps. This is what I'm looking for. Please tell me there's something challenging in this cave, please. We need to be challenged in New Game Plus. Hang on, is that a se seeker token? It's totally a seeker token right there. Oh, oh, I'd not have thought we'd find one here. A splendid discovery. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. Well, it's going to be a while until you go back to your own master, because you're doing a really good job, and I'm not letting you go anytime soon. <laughs> Alright, I don't see anything else around here. I heard something. You can hear it?
Just oh, I. Time we pressed on, wouldn't you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah totally. But I can hear, I can hear like monsters, man. Don't rush me, man. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be a tough one. Try not to get hit, lest all that bin go to waste. Let my magic grant you an elemental boon. A little bit of fire. I haven't used fire in a while. It felt, it felt appropriate to use some fire for a change. <laughs> Here, guys. You want a little taste? That was well fought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. No doubt this triumph will spur us into the next. Oh, there's a chest right here. Ah, a material. Useful things, these. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. Different Ooh. constant agonizing commentary from the pawn results in me getting tired of the pawn. Interesting. <coughs> I heard so. Ha! 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 Surprise, mother! That ability is just, <laughs> it drains my stamina, but it's so awesome. Eat some fire, buddy. Take your knees out. In your face. should be in the options, Madison, for sure. Like, it shouldn't need to be a specialization to, like, make them less talkative. It should be something you can trigger in the option to have, like, have the the bark options be frequent. You know, because, like, Pillars of Eternity does that. Um, Baldur's Gate does that. You, could, you can have, um, you know, how often are your companions spouting off nonsense, you know? But uh, it's kind of weird how they have it as like a thing that you can go obtain, but it's not like a default option. It just seems very backwards. Uh, I don't mind. Yeah, I, I don't dig it. I don't mind it. And sometimes it's quirky, but after you've heard the same lines of dialogue like 50 times, it's it's no longer cute or amusing. It's like, ugh. What is down here? Might there be aught over there? Let us ponder how best to proceed. It's like a quest icon over here. We or like a something a interesting. Slip us by, no matter how small. Pray speak up. Should you notice aught amiss? Hmm. <laughs> 
I don't know what we're looking for, but there's another tunnel here. Which leads to, like, another exit? Oh, I don't know about you, Master, but I'm worn out. Mightn't we have... Is there no getting through this door? You just blew it up. We're totally going through this door. It's a pretty big cave system. Uh, it's leading somewhere outside. Boring! Come on, what's down in the depths? I'm no longer scared of caves, guys. Like, I was totally terrified of caves during my first playthrough. Now that I'm in New Game Plus, it's like, whatever. What you got? What's down in here? Ain't nothing scare me at this point. I face dragons, bitches. Jasper! Cool. Please don't be deep water. Please don't be deep water. Please don't be deep water. Cool. Well, that was worth it. We found a whole bunch of cool caves around here. Around the elven kingdoms. Very groovy. Um, do I have any... I don't... I think I only have one. I don't even see it. Who picked it up? I did. There it is. <gasps> I can't use it because I haven't uncovered the uh, stone in the city yet. Uh, so in order to get back, I need to probably... Probably just run back. It's a quest. All right, pawns. On the way back to the city at this point. It, it, it's it's not even it's so bad yeah Ben it's like one moment it's this. super difficult and then like literally because if you watch my stream yesterday afternoon like we were we were that the fights were difficult all the way up to that final boss fight the final dragon fight and then I start new game plus this morning I get my pawns set up I get my gear out of storage um, I go out and it's been face roll nimble, face like roll face roll over and over and over, and over. like there's just no I mean, it's it's great from a, you know, do storyline content perspective for sure. So Go do all the things that you didn't do the first time. That part I really I, I I appreciate. But yeah, there's, you know, like I think Jedi Survivor did it really well when you finished up and you went into game New Game Plus. Uh, Jedi Survivor had it to where um, the boss mobs all had new mechanics. Um, and so the fights were not only more difficult, everything had more hit points, you were doing less damage, you know, everything was... Okay. Thank you, Mr. Elf. Um, so, you know, you would get that enhanced level of difficulty plus, you know, bonus mechanics on the fights that weren't there in the normal mode of the game. So I think, I think new game mode for Jedi Survivor was done very, very well. Um, whereas here, it's just kind of like, here, you know how there's 999 levels in the game? Go out and get some more levels. Like, go play with other vocations. Like, cool. But also, I guess, here's something to consider. Here's something to ponder. Some of this is probably because of the fact that I am max level with my vocation. And I've got the max level of those abilities. So... Um, I'm sure if I were to switch to Mage, as an example, I wouldn't be doing nearly as much DPS because I would be starting off as a level 1 Mage, 
with no sorcerer build at my disposal and you know going going over it there but i have things that i want to max out with this build you know but at the same time it's like i i feel like at this point the only challenge left would be to go hunt down drakes and dragons um because there's nothing else challenging me like the the minotaurs are a joke the the cyclops are a joke the um what else is there that we've seen the um minotaurs cyclops the ogres they've all just been jokes in new game plus mode um correct madison you get all the new armor sets um with new gear and everything else it just it doesn't it's not that good Like, here's that Minotaur we just faced a few minutes ago. Like, that was zero challenge. Ox carts make for relatively Ooh. safer Ooh. travel. Where are you going, bro? Wouldn't mind a chance to doze off as the hills roll by. Where are we going? This ox cart's bound for Vernon. Happily take it. Happily, happily. I'll take you anywhere till I've had my due. Here, take your 200 coin. Let's doze off. Throw something nasty at me. Come on. <laughs> at last nope. we've arrived. Delivery in hand. I only hope the recipient is pleased with our work. You have my support. Well, we've done a good job. Um, cool, everybody. Well, I'm going to wrap it here. Um, I've done everything I needed to do today. I've got a couple of segments I can clip out. I've already got to tomorrow's video pre-recorded. Um, I got all my new armor sets. I'm trying to think if there's anything I didn't do today that I needed to get done. Hmm. All right. For those of you who are here, uh, go to, if you're watching, if you're, cause we're multi-streaming on YouTube and Twitch, um, go over to YouTube and in the community posts section, I've got a vote going on right now about, um, whether or not I'm going to be playing Death's Stranding or Ghosts of Tsushima next. Ghost is winning by like 60%. It was a little while ago. Let's go see what it is right now. Um, so more than likely, that's probably what I'm going to end up playing next. Um, I will be playing Dragon's Dogma 2 through until the end of the week, more than likely. But I won't be playing it into April. Um, I'm done with the game. I'm not doing a completionist run. Um, I've got a few more guides that I need to make. So my gameplays right now are mostly about satisfying the prerequisites I need to make the guides that I need to make. But once we get to next week, I think we're going to be firmly into other stuff. So we're going to be finishing Final, Final, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. I'm going to be doing Hellblade 1, which is a very short playthrough, but I've never played it. So I'm going to do that at some point in April. And we're either going to our next like big game. Like we're going to go from here to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And as we start to mix into that, we're going to start to look at another stream game. I don't want to only stream Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. It's a fun game to play. It's not a fun game to stream all the time because when they make you do all the mini games that shit drives me nuts and I'm, it's no good to stream those because you're learning new systems and you're failing constantly it's not very fun um so more than likely uh if the vote keeps going right now it is currently skewed heavily in favor it is 78 percent in favor of ghosts of tsushima there's 240 votes and it's 78 percent say go play ghost of tsushima so i think that's probably where we're going to be playing um next and having that be a mainstream session so that that'll probably start sooner rather than later i may may wait until next week i may not um i may go do offline an offline let's play session to record and upload we'll see and i've got new world um the new patch goes live on the 2nd of april which is next tuesday I'm going to do four or five guides around that. Uh, they're adding native controller support to New World. So I'm at least going to... I already downloaded it today. I'll patch up next week. But I want to try that with the controller support now that it's been added. Because I haven't played it since it launched like three years ago or whatever it was. I'm going to do a should you play it in 2024 
new game guide 2024 and um the controller update so i'll do like three videos on new world next week but there's not going to be any playthroughs it's just going to be let's go test the new features anyway there are posts up go vote uh, for those of you who are doing the multi-stream, thank you very much for being here. To those of you who support, I appreciate it. Let's me do this full time. Bits, cheers, and subs on Twitch, super chats, super thanks, and memberships on YouTube. I just put out a member video this morning for those of you who are on YouTube, so you can go watch that. And then I'll catch everybody later in Discord or in um, or the Patreon. Uh, tonight's Wednesday. There will probably be a stream tonight. We're going to be doing World of Warcraft uh, tonight. I believe we're doing. The weekly is just dungeons, I think, like Mythic Dungeons. So I think we're going to be doing Mythic Dungeons tonight. So I should be live between 5 and 6 p.m. Central Time. Um, and we'll stream for a couple of hours. It's, it's going to be me, Kel. I can't remember who else is coming. I think Duck's going to be there. So there's a bunch of people from our World of Warcraft community. So there will be a second stream today here in about, like, what, five hours? Something like that. Which means... I'm going to go finish up my video production for the day, have some lunch, take a nap, and I'll see some of you later tonight. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow morning as we continue to play different things.